Hey guys, my name is Freedom. Today I'm going to show you how to create a great wall in 5 minutes by using the Blender 3.6 3D animation and 3D modeling software. So start from now, I'm going to show you step by step. Right, first I'm going to press A and press delete button to delete everything. Next, I'm going to add a mesh, add, add a cube, then change it to edit mode, right click it, merge the vertices at the center. Then, this is to create the path, the curve for the great wall. So you have to make sure you click the Z and make sure you view in XY plane and select it, select it and press E to extrude. This is to extrude the curve of your great wall. Here, E to extrude. Right. Once done already, press A to select all, and then press Ctrl B for bevel, and press V for vertices, and you drag it. Make sure it is smooth like this. Right. Once you done already, then switch it to object mode. Now you can see this is a curve. Then just name this as the curve and right click it, convert to curve. Next, we are going to create a module of the grid wall. Just go and add, add a mesh and make sure the red line, the Z axis is, is over there and Y axis is over another side. Go to the edit mode, right click and subdivide. Subdivide a few times like this is enough. Then, next, we are going to select the two rows of the surface. Click here to, to only select the surface. Click and press Ctrl, select one. And hold the shift, click here and hold the Ctrl click here to select like this and press E to extrude extrude to extrude approximately two boxes like this and, and then next next we are going to extrude this one one hold the shift one two three four five six seven seven eight and press e to extrude one approximately one box and then you can back to the object mode this is exactly the module and click your curve and press s maybe you want to make it bigger then next Click your walls, your grid wall module, and then go to the modifier, add a modifier, add an array. Next, click the add modifier again and add a curve. This curve, just make sure you select your curve like this. Then, under your array, just drag the count like this. And then check your grid wall. Now it is really a grid wall. As, as you see, it is really a grid wall. And if you feel satisfied already, first select from the array, click here, click apply. Next one is the curve. You must apply the array first before you apply the curve. Click here, apply. Now this is exactly the whole mesh of the great wall. You can press G to move it with the Y axis. And the curve is still a curve. You can use it to do other things. For example, the flag, array, etc. And this is really the great wall that you generated by using a curve and a module of a wall. 
here we have have some problem and uh, most probably it is just because of the the curve problem you just have a look have a check I just press ctrl Z to check it and now I may just hide the cube and check the curve what, what happened at here go to the the edit mode and see because of here it is so many points so maybe we, we are going to move this to make it further away press press G X here. if I delete one of the point the vertices here press G X it will be better and this one two stick together just delete one of it press delete button delete the vertices and now we check again the scene it now everything get perfect already just after you double check you feel satisfied and this is really a perfect great wall then click the cube again click the cube back to the object mode click the cube and then the modifier just apply the array and apply the curve now done this is exactly the grid wall press G Y to move it away and see now you can use this grid wall to create your 3d animations to create your 3d game assets or just make it as a model and do some of the further modeling on this grid wall all right that's all for today about my tutorial on how to create a grid wall in blender 3.6 and that's all for today thank you for watching if you love my videos tutorials and sharing if you feel all these tutorials and sharings are very helpful to your 3d modeling 3d animation and 3d game developing you can subscribe to my youtube channel and also turn on the mini bell and select all so that when next time i publish a new videos tutorials or sharing you receive a notification immediately see you in my next video enjoy happy 3d modeling 3d animation and 3d game developing see you